Thanks for joining us for the news at 10. Tonight, Eagle City Council voted to pay the Ada County Sheriff's Office millions of dollars to provide law enforcement services for the next fiscal year. New contract is for about four and a half million dollars, which is roughly $800,000 more than last year's contract. And most of that money is going to help soften the blow from, of course, inflation and growth that we've been seeing in Eagle. Abby Davis was at that meeting tonight. Negotiations for this contract, though, we've been talking about this for a little bit. Yeah, right. We actually first covered this story back in July and back Back then, the sheriff's office was concerned the city might not give them the money they need. Last year, the city paid about $3.7 million for services. At the time, Eagle Mayor Jason Pierce said they were willing to pay more, but he was worried some residents were paying double for services. That's because Eagle police officers respond to calls on, nearway, on nearby highways, which Pierce thinks is more of a county responsibility. During tonight's meeting, Pierce said they've always done what the sheriff's office has asked of them, including upping the budget. You know, some of the things we've seen on this contract negotiation that have been really good is we've seen the number of calls our officers, our proactive calls have gone up tremendously. We've seen more presence of the actual sheriff officers doing some of the things that they're supposed to be doing on the highways and other. Although the contract passed unanimously, Council President Brad Pike did have some concerns about where all the money will come from. $500,000 of the increase is just to maintain the level of service the sheriff's office currently provides. That's where inflation comes in. The other $300,000 will go toward hiring two more deputies because remember the city actually annexed Avamore and that drastically increased the size of Eagle. How in the world can you add, ask for additional officers when you've already put $503,000 out of your budget into that increase for status quo. As previously said, they would have needed to cut back services if the city didn't give them at least $4.2 million. But after tonight's decision, remember they got $4.5 million, they won't need to do that. Eagle Police Chief Ryan Wilkie said, quote, we are excited about the opportunity to continue our contract and the possibility of growing our department along with the city. So again, after months of uncertainty, there's now a plan and a set budget. Well, I think for a lot of people at home that may not know, Eagle has been contracting with the sheriff's office, as have multiple yes. other cities, CUNA, STAR. So they currently provide their police officers, yet they're considered city police officers. So it's a little bit confusing. It is, yes. But now, now there's a plan. Yeah, a plan. All right, Abby, thank you.